Before Paris Hilton became New York City's It Girl in 2001, before she starred in The Simple Life, before her sex tape One Night in Paris was viewed by everybody, Paris' great grandfather Conrad Hilton he built the Hotel Empire. She spent her childhood moving from one luxurious mansion to the next. While in high school she was bullied and she dreamed of becoming a singer or an actress. My name is Michael McCrudden and welcome to Before They Are Famous documenting the life of Paris Hilton prior to fame. She was born Paris Whitney Hilton in New York City on February 17, 1981. She is the eldest to sister Nikolai and brother Baron and Conrad. Her father Richard Hilton is a real estate developer and her mother Kathy Richards Hilton is a socialite and former actress. The Hilton Empire is worth an estimated $4 billion. Talk about being born with a silver spoon, this silver spoon is gold and diamond encrusted. She's got it all, whatever you want. If you found a magic lamp, she wouldn't even wish for wealth. She'd be like, uh, I wish that sex tape never happened. But then wouldn't she be famous? Anyway, we'll get back to that. Given the childhood nickname Star by her mother and grandmother, Paris began modeling as a child. She aspired for a career as a singer or an actress. She was very theatrical around the house. She would always put on beauty pageants and singing shows. She also had her own personal petting zoo filled up with all sorts of crazy creatures. She moved frequently in her youth, living in a suite in the Waldorf Astoria Hotel in Manhattan. Prior to that, she lived in the Hilton Mansion in Beverly Hills, which boasts over 40 rooms. She also spent a lot of time living in the Hamptons. Her close friends growing up included Nicole Richie, Kimberly Stewart, and Kim Kardashian. She also went to school with Lady Gaga, but the two of them, they weren't friends. She attended high school in both LA and New York City, and was enrolled in a number of different schools. Both bullying and rule breaking were both frequent occurrences happening in her life at this time. When she was 19, she signed with Donald Trump's modeling agency, T Management. Around this time, she became a daily feature of entertainment news for her partying which only boosted her success as a model. She made a brief cameo in Ben Stiller's film Zoolander. She was also cast in the straight to video film Honey Bunny. It was a horror and it didn't do very well. In 2003 she became engaged to fashion model Jason Shaw but they broke up soon after. She also had a short fling with Leonardo DiCaprio and boxer Oscar De La Hoya. Near the end of 2003 an unauthorized video of Paris Hilton engaging in sexual acts with boyfriend from the past Rick Solomon began circulating on the web. It was titled One Night in Paris. Guilty of watching it. It was pretty good. Three weeks after the release of the video, Hilton debuted her first reality television venture with Fox. She partnered with longtime friend Nicole Richie, and the two of them went on to go and experience the simple life, or what the rest of us call reality. But on a reality TV show. It was feared that Hilton's scandal would ruin ratings and alienate potential audiences, but the show became an enormous success. And the rest of the story, well you know the story because this is Before They Were Famous. My name is Michael McCrudden, thanks for watching, now I need you to do me a favor and subscribe to this channel. I'm making all sorts of great videos on entertainment and celebrity biographies, so be sure to subscribe. Also let me know in the comments down below what celebrity do you want me to do next? Someone requested Paris Hilton, so here it is, but there's all sorts of great stuff on here, Eminem, Nicki Minaj, Kim Kardashian, be sure to check them all out. Alright guys, see you in the next video.